These are the seven habits of highly effective people. What do great businessmen, artists, and inventors all have in common? They all share similar habits that allow them to enable actions that change not only their lives, but the lives of those around them and of the world. Habit number one, be proactive. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. This is the most foundational habit of any highly effective person because it allows you to empower yourself. It gives you the initiative and the responsibility to make things happen. The more I read about business, psychology, history, autobiographies about great people, the more I see this habit pop up. Your life is a product of your values, not your feelings. Your life is a product of your decisions, not your conditions. Now, I'm not saying you can't have feelings. Feelings are great. They're what make us human. But to be effective, And just to have that personal freedom, you need to take responsibility for your feelings and know that your feelings don't define your actions and they don't define you as a person. What you do when no one is watching, that's who you are as a character. That's who you are at the end of the day. You can feel like you want to change the world. You can feel like a family man. But do you spend time with your family? Do you provide for them? Are you a pillar of your community? Do you help in the community? Feelings and actions are two different things, guys. Come on. I've been struggling with this fact. I feel like it wasn't really to the last couple of years of my life. I think really after COVID where I started taking responsibility for myself, for my health, my career, my ambitions, my dream, my creativity. And every day I still have to remind myself that I'm responsible for myself for every action that i do there's no one else there no other person can control me and take away my personal freedom and with that personal freedom that i have that i choose to have because i take responsibility i try to spread this fact to other people i try to tell them the gospel the truth of it all whether that's in their relationships every relationship you have has a problem What do they all have in common? And it can be hurtful to hear that. It can be really emotionally bittersweet to know that every problem that you ever had in your life stems from one person, yourself. And when you have given years of emotional responsibility to an outside factor or an outside person, it's a struggle to reclaim your personal responsibility. But... When you are able to say that you are the person who you are today because of the choices you make yesterday, that is the first step to unlocking your greatest potential, the potential to be the person you want. Now, if you watched my last video on stagnation, many of those bad habits or those pitfalls are just because you don't take the initiative. And I can't boil down all the complex solutions and problems in the world to just take responsibility. But if every problem comes from a person, a personal problem within themselves, imagine how much better the world would be if everyone took responsibility of their mistakes, their actions, and their feelings. A man can dream. But what a man can do is take responsibility for himself today and be proactive. Now to end this video off with a quote, from the book. After that's all said and written, being proactive comes down to two things. First, take responsibility of your life right now. Second, take initiative. It's that simple. Be an agent, not a victim. Don't wait for life to happen to you. Be the driver of your own life, not just a passenger. Live out of your imagination, not from your past. And guys, I just want to say thank you for always for watching the video. I don't know how many people really finished the video. I don't blame them. Sometimes I don't rewatch my videos. But, you know, to those who do, I've always appreciated you guys. And I just hope that I can be the person that you think I am. And a lot of my friends, a lot of people I know in my life, I like to see the best version of them, the potential. Sometimes in life, all you need is just that one person who believes in you more than you believe in yourself. And if you feel like you don't have anyone like that, you have me. I believe in you. But what you need to do for me 
is to be proactive and take responsibility. Good night, my friends. I'll see you in the next video.